up guys, it's Max here. In this video, I'm really excited to show you all how to make a very useful emergency solar panel charging station. And it folds out to five solar panels, which is an equivalent of 30 volts if they're six volts each. Six times five, that's 30 volts, and convert it down into five volts to be able to charge any cell phone or any other device that is powered with five volts. And all this folds up something to the size that you can fit inside your pocket. Alright, so without further ado, let's get started making this useful gadget. Now if you're also doing this project, make sure you're using silicon coated wire as it can handle a lot of flexing and bending as some of the other wires do not. Take your five solar panels, lay them out, and you're going to solder them together with the flexible wire. Make sure you're wiring up the panels in series, which is a positive to negative connection. Now that these panels are wired up in series, they generate about 30 volts. I decided to use a pair of old shorts for the material for my folding solar panels. We're going to shove a flattened cereal box into one of the pants, which is going to help us to easily draw a line across where we're going to cut. Once you finish cutting out the piece of fabric, you should be able to fold it in half like this. Now you're going to sew the piece of fabric together. My sewing skills may not be top notch, but I think I did a pretty good job sewing it together. What do you think? Take a long section of wire which is about the length of all our panels and solder it on to the end of one of our panels. This will be running throughout the whole solar panel strip. Solder on a short section of wire to the other end of the strip of panels. Now it's time to glue the strip of panels to the piece of fabric. Using popsicle sticks, you're going to make a simple box which is going to sit right here and hold the rest of our charging components. Be sure to solder the output wires from the charging component to the female USB port. You see those two wires sticking out from the solar panel? Well, you're going to connect them up to the input wires of the charger. Now I'm going to try to make a charging indicator.
Now I'll solder on a couple of wires to the charging indicator. One is to the side where all the resistors are and another wire to the other side where the LEDs are connected to. Now you're going to fuse it to the connection of the female USB port. Then you're going to close off all of the components that sit in this box by making a roof. Be sure to super glue the box to the fabric. Hmm, you know what detail we're missing here? The Velcro. Let's put some on. Now guys, we're done with the foldable pocket solar charger. Alright my friends, that should wrap it up for this video showing you all how to make a foldable solar panel charging station for any 5 volt devices such as cell phones, power banks, or even the taser I made in my last video. You should go check that out. Link is in the description. Now do keep in mind solar panels aren't as efficient as wall chargers that you have in your home in terms of the speed of charging. These row of solar panels charge my phone in about twice the amount of time than a normal outlet would. And yeah, it's a bit slower because of the amperage. It's a bit lower than a normal outlet would give to your phone. And that's okay. Even if you're out in the bush or something or you're out camping, it's really handy to have one of these as it would still charge your phone. So it would be better if you found some solar panels with a higher amount of amps so that it can charge your phone faster. The indicator may have not been too practical, but it indicates if you're getting enough light on the panels to charge your phone. And your phone already has a little thing at the top right corner saying, you know, how much you're phone is charged. <laughs> so you don't really need a charging indicator. To support me and the content I create, I would much appreciate if you all give this video a like, share it with your friends, and subscribe with the notification bell on to never miss an upcoming video. Thank you all for watching. Have a nice day. See you guys. Peace.